Yo, what's up, my people? Welcome back to another this week in WWE 2K23, my faction. There's been so much going on in WWE 2K23, my faction. I apologize that I'm a little late with your, you know, your weekly starter, the main one that a lot of people are concerned with. Usually, uh, outside of reviews, is when I break down the daily logins, the live events, and the weekly towers. But we here now, and um. As you can see this week, you log in five days, you get the cash in collective, but there's something else big going on right now. I'm not even gonna break down all the tr contracts and everything. The main thing is you wanna log in and get the cash in collective. I think the cash in collective pack is a very good pack. Uh, if we take a look at the cash in collective pack real quick. You'll see what, what I mean. All right, so going into this pack, you will see some great amethyst card a lot of people want the seth rollins out of this card you may get lucky and pull that the miz 11 as well a lot of people wanted that the Big E. some of these actually contain different attires and everybody wanted them so good pack um just at least for the nostalgia of it but you could always add in diamond you know badges and everything if you got that you know so just something to consider all right, so like I said, a lot is going down. Let's hit up the news real quick. You can see they're giving away a new locker code, 2K Strike Team. You put that locker code in, you are going to unlock some content. So let's go ahead and try to unlock some of that content right now with the Strike Team locker code. New this week. You see it there in all its glory, that 2K Strike Team. So what you wanna do, you wanna go down here to locker codes if you don't know, put in 2K, Strike team. And even if you don't really want to use the cards, do it anyway so it increase your collector's level. So you can get some of the you know pink diamonds and stuff from the collector's level or the diamonds, whatever you want out of the collector's levels. It's kind of late. If I sound a little sleepy, I do apologize. So here it goes. The my faction bonus. Yeah. Let's open up the side place first. These little old side plates here. All right, here we go. The lock of cold rewards. They had already had the Bobby Lashley. So the Shayna Baszler, Knight of Champions. That's cool. The Batista Summer Heat. And that 88. These are some good cars, man. This 88 and just Brock Lesnar and that uh just good cars all around they have batista and brock lesnar they offer a lot of strength uh they may be able to tap someone out you know even if they're there's a chance even though you're amethyst you can still tap somebody out diamond pink diamond uh with these amethyst cards so don't think because there's other things that you can't do it so like i said if whether you like the cards or not go ahead and cash it in it'll get you closer to your collector's level you see that code bam got me to pink diamond bianca belair which is the collector's level 22 uh 97 i'm so glad to have her because we're about i'm about to show you why let's take a good look at the live events coming in and i'm going to show you her event first just because i was just talking about her. <laughs> well i think that's upcoming that's an upcoming event So you can see right there, upcoming event for Bianca. You can get tons of MFP and a Montez Ford pink diamond. That's going to be live in four days. So I got there just in the nick of time. Still trying to get that Summer Heat Ultimate Warrior. That's something else. We're not going to talk about that now. Going to keep it moving because it's late. And I don't want to keep people woke. Carmella's birthday bash is live right now. You get in this event. You can get Chaos Packs, Alphabet Packs, Fast Lane, and 2000 MFP. Clutch Time Miz is still up. There are various things in this that you can win. For some reason, they're just not allowing you to see them. I don't know why they're doing it. You see, I got lucky ahead of time. I think my second or third time playing in Pool of Miz. If you guys want to see me do a gameplay with that, though I may do it anyway, uh, let me know. Uh, Chaos in the Cloud, if you just need a Chaos card, and you can win up to five, well, you can win 5,000 MFP, not up to. If you got a woman chaos card, 
then you can win 5,000 MFP by beating Alexa Bliss in Extreme Battle. And by the way, in this, um, you just gotta beat the Dangerous Doink. And then right here, Chaos Battle, if you have Shotzi Chaos, you're going to uh, take on Liv Morgan and Valhalla in a triple threat matchup. Falls Count Anywhere, Hell in a Cell match with a pink diamond prize. But that's not all you can get. Alphabet, Fast Lane, and uh, the Signature Series 2. You can get that as well. Three Giants is still alive for eight days for those that wanted to do it. I do agree that it's doable, but they increased and made the AI better in the last couple of patches. And it's been, it's crazy. If you got time to do it, you know, went through everything else, make sure you hit that up. Don't forget about it. A flare for Blair. If you got the Charlotte Flair Proving Grounds reward, you can get Latino heat packs and more. I went over these in previous episodes, so I'm not going to go over these at the bottom. But I will let you guys know what's coming up. Last chances for the Badge King. So in one day, this will be popping back up. So maybe I should maybe try to get those uh, summer heat packs again. <laughs> As you can see, I got everything I need except the, the Ultimate Warrior to start the thing off, which is kind of crazy. But also coming up, we're going to have a one-on-one -on -one matchup Lita event where it's Judgment Day in 2001. China got the best of Lita in a championship match. In a rematch using Lita, unlock the 400 cards collected to defeat the night one of the world. You get decorated packs as well as MFP. I'm looking forward to that because I like the historic ones. I do. I like the historic ones. Just always cool. I wish they do more historic events, but we'll see. We'll see. And uh, maybe in 2K24, if you can find a way, I don't know, to make it even more historic, please do so. Please do so. I also think you need to make it so that, like, the the artwork for the events are bigger, I feel like. I feel like that needs to be bigger. Then we can use them for thumbnails and whatnot. But right now, they're just kind of small i'll say make that bigger if you can some kind of way maybe you can um stretch out the overall rectangle that you got there a little further out but yeah i'm getting in design stuff right now y'all don't care about no design <laughs> i'm a graphic designer that's what i do um well i'm not up i don't have a job in graphic design but i went to school for graphic design and i use a lot of graphic design with my stuff on youtube so all right last but not least let's go ahead and check out the weekly job All right, it was summer heat last week. And once again, this week, I cannot really break down unless I do it in another video, which I probably won't. <laughs> week 36 is going to be about the Wesley. Get the Diamond Wesley this week in your weekly tower. I think overall, just looking at the card, it's going to be crazy. I like Wesley. I love using him in the game. He has one of the best movesets there is in the game. Just overall fun. He's fast. He's frantic. I think as a diamond, he's going to be something else to deal with. So, uh, love Wesley, or you just love, like, guys are just fun to use. You need to get that Wesley. You need to get it. So, um, I think that really, uh, hits everything up. Faction Wars will be ending in a couple of days, like in seven, in the upcoming week. Next week, uh, we'll get some new rewards. So don't forget to go ahead and uh, finish these get all these rewards out of Faction Wars. Usually I'll be done had them, but since there's so much going on I haven't even been able to Actually complete it. That's crazy, right? I haven't been able to complete it. I, I Can't believe that I haven't done it. That's crazy when I can't even believe it. <laughs> I can't even believe I haven't done it because normally I do it uh me personally, I only need to pull the Johnny Gargano. But get in there. Get your uh, Faction Wars on. And once again, guys, if I sound sleepy, I do apologize. But I put the content out here for you. <laughs> I did it this week. And uh, with that being said, let me know. What will you be going for? Are you going to be doing any of this? Have you moved on from my faction? Let me know in the comments below. Also, don't forget, I did a big review and uh, of the new diamond card, the new DLC 
from my faction that's out as well subscribe to the channel if you ain't done so already leave likes comments shares and all that and i'll see you guys next show next video i'm out of here peace